What's going on, guys? Mighty Dolph out back again, and it is playoff semi final eliminator day thingy with Ben. Hello, people. There is a world Ben. Huh? So, here is a world Ben. Score Hello, prediction. Um, 2 Hello. 1 Darcy. Hello, mate. Yeah. Here, I think. Next, yeah, next weekend, I'm fairly sure. Um, Sorry, what was your score position? I said 2 1 Darcy. 2 1 Darcy. Um, not optimistic given our, our um, as I run on um, in playoff games so I'm going to sort of a nervous 1-0 win for Dartford but I'm really not optimistic oh shit where's uh, um, yeah 0-0 uh, at the moment Jeffers if you do watch that video please sign for us next season uh, Number two is absolutely doing the standing right hand side. Away! Easy, Chinny, easy. Oh, Luke, hey. Yes, um, 13 minutes in, 1 0 Dartford. <laughs>
Oh, ball. That's offside. Oh, that goes. That's offside. Pushed away by Ben. It's a bit of a height down. Oh, fucking hell. Oh. Oh, fuck, man. Get your car Yeah, I saw that one on penalties, didn't I? Oh, I mean, I shouldn't condone it, but at the same time, it is pretty funny. Hands in my box. Oh, he was drinking the orange juice. Who are you in just been on fucking game, man. He's got the freedom of the M25 at like the right fucking wing. <laughs> and Bob is celebrating the goal he hasn't scored. Five points. Fair, Luke is having a shit shot. Ben! Place. 
Hey Mike, I've missed your Tourette's during games, mate. Come on! Up! Down! Oh, that's a goal kick. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Playing in our midfield, mate. I reckon you've got half a chance. Get your boots on, lad. Fucking hell, Bonds! Fucking cheating, dude. Fucking I really need to. <laughs> run, 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 run. Yes! Oh, you got! I'm in there! Shoot! Challenge! He tried and he fucking missed him. Why the fuck is Kieran gone for that? Snap him! 
Honestly, we turn into such bastards whenever we start losing or doing badly. Come on, Shep. Maxwell. Kill him. Jet, no. Maybe. Oh, Now cross. So, full time, after extra time, one all, we're going to penalties. Um, yeah. Come on, you darts.
Weight of the fucking club on your shoulders, son. Don't fuck it up. Contracts getting torn up if you miss. Full-time Dartford One, St Albans One, and a five-three loss on penalties. Um, yeah, pretty gutting stuff, to be fair. Um, I think if we're on it, like I, obviously there's a lot of pessimism going into the game. Um, obviously, last three playoffs we've been involved in. Um, I believe we've lost on penalties. Obviously, last year losing out to Chippenham, I think it was, and then obviously during COVID losing, losing the playoff final to Weymouth on penalties. Um, yeah, I don't. It's disappointing, really. I think at times. St Albans were the better team, but or they played the better football, but we had so many chances that we just couldn't put away. And arguably that does sum up our season somewhat, you know. Um, players not being available at the right time or players rushing themselves back. Um, no, I've got to say... Um, it is... Very much a bit. It's very gutting. Um, obviously, as I said, I can't say I wasn't pessimistic going into the game, but it, it's never nice to see your team lose a playoff semi final. And I think equally, it's never nice to see your team lose on penalties. It, it's sort of very much a real kick in the teeth. Um, my heart goes out to Samir Carruthers. Um, you could see after his uh, missed spot kick, his he was in bits afterwards, and obviously, I think every dart for play you could just see it in their faces afterwards. They were just gutted. Um, I think though, at the start of the season, if you had offered us second in the league with a very thin squad like it's very I, I, I struggle or I try not to use the, the phrase threadbare but that's probably the easiest way of describing it is it was very threadbare we had a very very thin squad um, but once again we have just come up short I mean next season will be the telling point, I guess, with Dowsey being able to bring in the players he wants to bring in. Um, 
I think a lot of these players are not his his type of players. And to be fair, the sheer determination for the lads to get us into the playoffs and second was very, very impressive. Um, highlights of the season, obviously, doing the double over fleet. But there have also been some low points, obviously, FA Cup, FA Trophy exits. Um, yeah. I think um, man the match, I'm going to go for... Probably because it's the last time I'll be able to sort of give him one, but Harvey Bradbury obviously took our took the our goal very well. Um Wang had a match. <laughs> Again I'm probably gonna shoot myself in the foot because no doubt we'll end up signing him, but I'm gonna say Sean Jeffers. Um But yeah, I've got to say um as well massive like congratulations to um to St Albans for getting through to the playoff final. Uh, they play next week again away at, at um, Oxford City, which is obviously it's going to be a tough game. But whoever wins, I think we'll just have to wait and see. But yeah, um, but thanks for watching, guys. Thank you for all the support this season. Um, it, it obviously it sucks. It ends this way, but that's football. And you know, life of being a Dartford fan. But yeah, um, just want to before I do sort of sign off. For this final uh, video, I do just very quickly uh, want to give a massive shout out to Nigel, who does all the uh, media stuff at Willem. So, honestly, one of the nicest guys off the pitch. Um, always got time for a chat. Always sort of like there. And to be fair, this season has really sort of helped out behind the scenes with just sort of just sort of being there for me to bounce ideas off. But massive shout out to him, massive shout out to Ben, Mitch, anyone else who's appeared this season. Because obviously, I mean, I've been doing this a long old time now, but you know, this started uh, if, without everyone else. I'll just be a lunatic yelling into a camera, and I am a lunatic yelling into a camera, but at least I have people who say funny things around me, so. But, yeah, um, thanks for watching, guys, and, yeah, I will probably do a sort of end of season summing up everything, um, But yeah, it, it it does suck. But you know, we'll we'll see what pre season holds. Um, and yeah, I think I'm gonna leave it there. But thanks for watching, guys. Thank you for the support this season, and I'll see you. Well, I'll see you for the sort of roundup video in quotation marks, and then I'll see you for pre season. So, up the dots.